It's been more than 25 years since Kay Charter had an experience that changed her life. A family of winter wrens emerged from their nest under a brush pile near where she was sitting. Winter wrens were losing ground due to loss of habitat, so Kay took an idea to her husband. If they sold their waterfront home, they could use the proceeds to purchase a large tract away from the bay and establish a safe haven for migrating and nesting birds. Six months later, they owned a 47-acre piece of land in Omina. The property they bought had everything, meadows, woods, wetlands, and a creek. And to provide better habitat for the birds, they started removing invasive species like autumn olive and spotted knapweed and planting native plants which are important to the birds. Howard Youth, editor and senior writer for the American Bird Conservancy, explains. One of the things that people think is the best thing they can do is to put out bird feeders. But I would argue that the best thing to do is to put out native plants if you're going to use pesticides and if you're going to really do your homework because it's affecting not only humans but also the birds and as important their food base which is insects. Without the insects during nesting season most birds cannot survive. To connect people to the many species of birds that visited the property and raise awareness of their populations, Kay led walks on their property. In 2000 her book For the Love of Birds was published. In the summer of 2001 Kay organized a handful of conservation-minded friends who helped establish Saving Birds Through Habitat. Two years later, the organization's Habitat Discovery Center was dedicated on property the charters donated. Well, since then, the organization has invited thousands of people of all ages to learn about birds and their needs, helped establish three birding festivals, and provided scores of programs and events featuring conservation speakers from around the country. Best-selling, award-winning author Doug Tallamy is a supporter and frequent speaker. Kay has presented programs across the country, and in 2019, she joined American Bird Conservancy's Steve Homer, Vice President of Policy, to lobby congressional leaders on issues affecting birds. Our goal is to improve habitat for these beautiful creatures one backyard at a time, or 10, or 100. You can help by joining Saving Birds Send a check to Post Office Box 288, Omina, Michigan, 49674, or go online to our website, savingbirds.org, and you can donate with your credit card. Yeah, he's taking a picture of him.